We can convert to and from engineering notation on a graphing calculator. And all we have to do is go to our mode button right here. And I'm going to select the normal mode first. Click enter. That's this mode right here. And now what I can do, if I enter a number that's in engineering notation, of course, like let's say 1, 2, 3.01 times 10 to the 6th power, right? If I enter this, I convert from engineering notation to normal notation. There are limits on this. If your number has more than 10 digits, then it can't be displayed. What it'll end up doing is converting the number from engineering notation to scientific notation. And if your number has an absolute value smaller than 0 .001, the same thing applies. Uh, if you have a really small number, it will not display a normal notation. But we can do the reverse. If we go to our mode right here, and you see it says scientific and then engineering notation, if we scroll to the right and pick engineering, now what's going to happen is that whatever number we enter in, let's say it's, um, I don't know, 300. If I enter this number in and I press enter, what's returned is the number in engineering notation. And this means, of course, 300 times 10 to the 0 power. This E means times 10. And the number after the E is the exponent. And this will work for any number um, that you enter. So let's enter this number in. Just pressing enter, it converts it to engineering notation. Alright, hope this helped.